Dan ulangilah kalimat yang betul sesudah Jane. Siap, saudara-saudara? Where do they live? She asked where they lived. When will you finish? She asked when he'd finish. How many people are there in your family? She asked how many people there were in his family. Kalimat tadi cukup panjang, bukan? Coba ucapkan lagi bagian demi bagian sesudah Jane. She asked how many people. Sekarang coba ulangi kalimat seluruhnya. She asked how many people there were in his family. Baiklah. Akhirnya beberapa pertanyaan yang kata kerjanya dalam bentuk lampau dan harus diubah sebagai berikut. Coba dengarkan. Where did she go? He asked where she'd gone. Apakah saudara masih ingat perubahan seperti tadi dalam reported speech untuk menjelaskan apa yang telah dilakukan sebelumnya? Did you go? You had gone. Coba dengarkan beberapa contoh lagi. When did you go? He asked when she'd gone. Why did you go? He asked why she'd gone. How did you go? He asked how she'd gone. Nah, sekarang saudara akan mendengar pertanyaan disusul oleh bentuknya yang tidak langsung. Coba saudara ulangi pertanyaan tidak langsungnya saja. Siap saudara-saudara? When did you go? He asked when she'd gone. Why did you go? He asked why she'd gone. Where did you go? He asked where she'd gone. How did you go? He asked how she'd gone. Dan dia pergi naik apa? Mari kita dengarkan. How did you go to Indonesia? Well, I went by plane to Bali and then from there to Jakarta. Then I traveled by train and by bus in Java. Did you like Indonesia? Oh, yes. It was marvelous. But, Iwan, you have asked me a lot of questions. I want to ask you some questions. Now, what do you think about Australia? What are your impressions? Saudara pendengar, wawancara Iwan dan Miss Alice telah selesai dan Iwan sudah berada kembali di rumah keluarga Scott. Well, Iwan, tell us about the interview with the reporter. Yes, what happened? Well, she asked a lot of questions. What did she ask, Iwan? She asked where I lived and why I'd come to Australia. She asked me about my family and what my father did. And lots of things. And she said she's going to write a story in the newspaper about me. Really? Iwan, you'll be famous. <laughs> <laughs> Was she nice, Iwan? Oh, yes. Very attractive. Did she know much about Indonesia? Yes, she's been to Indonesia. So I asked her a lot of questions, too. I asked where she'd gone and how she'd traveled and so on. Did she ask about your life in Australia? Yes. She asked if I liked Australian food and if I missed my family and whether I felt very cold in winter and if I liked going to the beach and when I would go back to Indonesia. Oh, she asked a lot of questions, she, Iwan. Yes, she did. And after the interview, I asked if she wanted to have dinner with me. When? Tonight. Now, I must hurry. I don't want to be late for Geraldine. Geraldine? Who's Geraldine? That's Miss Alice's first name, Geraldine. She's very nice. 
I'm going to meet her at seven o'clock. We're going to an Indonesian restaurant. Bye. Nah, ternyata Iwan senang sekali berwawancara dengan wartawan tadi, dan mereka berdua akan makan malam bersama-sama. Saudara pendengar, sudah saatnya kami minta diri. Tetapi jangan lupa membaca bagian yang berjudul After the Broadcast dari pelajaran tadi. Dan pelajarilah bagian yang berjudul Before the Broadcast dari pelajaran nomor 65. Goodbye, listeners. Goodbye, listeners.